Hey guys, about to play a game with Rasputin Dreamweaver. And we have a bad hand we're going to have to send back. And we are against Lazov Demer Mastermind. So our opponent's going to like mill us probably and make copies of our dudes. Well, that's pretty good. We don't have any white, but... But I think we still keep... And there's white, so that's good. That works out. Do I play my soul ring? Yeah, or my conclave. Um, at this point, I mean, especially because we know what we're going to draw, playing soul ring doesn't seem super relevant. So, I mean, now we'll do it, obviously. So we're up to five man already. <laughs> yeah, let's get these guys out there. I wouldn't mind one of those. Um... We're going to get in there with our fairy land. They just did that so I could leave white up to represent like swords to plowshares or path to exile or something. Two, three, four, five. So next turn we can play our commander. And if he gets to stay around, the next turn we can cast Cause Elect the Great Distortion. Or Inkwell Leviathan. I probably will play Kozilek first, though, because it draws me, it'll draw me a bunch of cards. Okay. Well, I think we go for it. See if our opponent's packing counter magic. If he is, he's kind of a bad, bad person, because this is Commander. Come on. <laughs> All right. I mean, playing a few counter spells is okay, but... A deck that runs like 30 of them is, especially in one-on-one -on -one commander, is just, it's just wrong, I think. So we can play Kozilek next turn. And no matter what, even if our opponent did counter it, we get to draw four cards. Actually, it'll, it might be more. No, it'll probably be four. So here comes Lazov. He could, the bad news about Kozilek is he could make a copy of, uh, oh no, he's playing Jace. The most disgusting Jace of all time. Yeah, that's... That'll work. That will work. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six. We're not quite at a point where we can just, like, play Inkwell Leviathan after... Well, that'll help. After casting Rasputin. But I suppose if we keep making him bounce Rasputin, that's not the worst thing in the world, right? Now it's pretty bad, I guess. I think we just play our lantern. And then we kill Jace with this. Uh, I already did that. Okay. Bam. Get out of here. And then we end our turn. So we have eight mana now. That means we can um, play Rasputin and then immediately play Inkwell Leviathan. If our opponent taps out, that's probably what we do, especially because Island Walk will be online. All right, let me reread this guy. You may have him become a copy, except for that it's name, and it gains hexproof. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Sounds good. I guess. Doesn't, doesn't actually, obviously. We can hard cast Kozilek soon, but I think we probably just want to play Rasputin and Inkwell Leviathan. 
Although, if we draw land, we can just hard cast our Leviathan. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, so I think we play Rasputin. And then immediately play Inkwell Leviathan. He'll recharge next turn. So if we draw a land, we can actually play Kozilek next turn. I mean, he won't recharge all the way. He'll he'll regain all but one counter, though. Here comes Inkwell. Turn six, Inkwell Leviathan. Your turn. <laughs> Pretty gross. Pretty gross. Them some expensive lands. Board sweeper? I mean board sweeper would would be pretty good right now. Gilded Lotus is also pretty good right now. So two, three, four, five, six, six. So we have to draw a land and then we can cast Kozilek this turn. If Resputin's still alive. Okay. Well, he's not gonna be. <laughs> so so much for that plan. Um did he just evoke that? No, he tapped too much mana. He's actually playing it. No, he did evoke it. We can play our Gargantuan as a second Inkwell Leviathan, <laughs> which <laughs> we've won another match like that already in this playlist, but oh, man. That is that is not good. <laughs> we have Kozilek and Quicksilver Gargantuan in our hand. Ah. Oh, no. No. <laughs> oh, well. Frexied and Jester will deal with that. So, at least we did. At least that's at least we drew that. But that is Oh, uh, I'm going to just be like enjoy. Oh. <laughs> uh, that's wrong. It's wrong. And he can cipher. So actually he could make us discard these cards too. <laughs> yeah, I think we lose. I mean, this is a bad matchup when our opponent can make us discard our hand like that. Because it'll have Menace. He's a 12-12 Menace. Who can kill us in two swings. And then can then cipher our Phyrexian Ingester out of our hand. And our Ingester is pretty important. <laughs> it was like the way we drew to deal with it, but now it's gone. It's gone. Okay. All right. Well, Thought Vessel's not going to do it. Hmm. This is this is just great. Well, that's pretty good. Assuming he doesn't have a two mana card to discard. Let's see if we can get him to, like, counter my Thought Vessel here. We did not. Well, I think we just find out whether or not Cyclonic Rift is going to work, because we're just dead to a second hit from this. Do I have the mana to cast it with Overload, actually? I mean, I might as well, right? I do. Okay, lose the Kozilek. If you have a two mana converted mana cost card in your hand, I lose. If you don't, we keep playing. <laughs> That's simple as that. Simple as that. He's thinking. Okay, good. Whew. Well, 
This game's not over yet, guys. It was close. <laughs> close to being over, but not quite. I'm going to hold on to these lands. Uh, I can actually start making spirits because I have creatures in my graveyard. It doesn't happen very often, but that's what's funny is we only have 19 creatures in our deck, but our opponent managed to make us discard our freaking Kozilek. I mean, you know, we got to draw him. We were lucky to draw him in the first place, but getting smashed for 12 by my opponent's commander isn't exactly what I want to be doing. I can tell you that. So, replay some things. Okay, you gonna find a way to kill my Inkwell Leviathan and take it away from me too? Hello. I think we just swing. We want. We're probably just gonna cast White Sun Zenith at the end of our opponent's turn, and that might win us the game. It also might not. Right, twenty-one. So we have one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we can make seven tokens, seven uh, White Sun Zenith cat tokens. We we could have cast our commander, of course. But oftentimes you really only need to cast them once to get a huge advantage. I mean, I think you've seen that in the other two games because it should be the third one. Like, we just cast them once and we played an Inkwell Leviathan really early and... I mean, it is bet it is more fun sometimes when you ke get to keep recasting him, um, but we just haven't been able to do it. Protection from green and from blue. Okay, well, we're probably going to have to use our white sun zenith just to block this dude. Because we don't really want him getting a wolf token. Or milling us, because then Lazav could transform into something even scarier. All right. Tap all our mana. Make sure we add at least three white in the process. All right. So... We're just going to block with one cat. We could triple block and take him down. But this represents pretty much lethal damage. So I think just blocking with one is probably what we want to do. So that's 12. I mean, it's 19, so it's not quite lethal. But it is with Fairy Conclave. Okay, what a cat, an inkwell leviathan. I still think you're dead, right? This is five, ten. Oh no, I can only swing for seventeen. I can only swing hit him for nineteen now. Darn. What do we draw? Well, that's pretty good. <laughs> that is pretty good. I've been having people copy my Inkwell Leviathans a lot since I've been recording. <laughs> it's kind of funny. I probably should have made Fairy Conclave into a creature, but... This 
So this time our opponent's going to be able to mill us and we won't be able to stop it. So we have to hope. I mean, our best creatures, um, the other Kozilek wouldn't be great, but it wouldn't be the end of the world either. So I think we just play our Myogen here. Uh, we probably want to leave this untapped in case we draw some. Well, Path to Exile can't kill either of those things, but um, yeah. And then we're just gonna we're gonna remove the Divinity Counter right away and just just draw a big fistful of cards. A big fistful of cards. Why didn't it make me discard? Oh, <laughs> I have a my Thought Vessel in play. That's all right, well, we do have Tragic Arrogance to get us out of an ugly situation, should one arise. Okay, what creatures did he hit there? Clever Impersonator doesn't do anything because it has to come into play. Eternal Dragon is big, but not that scary. Eldrazi Displacer could be a problem, but I still don't think it wins him the game. I don't think he hit anything. I think like our biggest, if he'd hit one of our our other Eldrazi, like Artisan of Kozilek would probably be pretty bad. He could get back Shriek, Shriek Ma, stuff like that. But I don't think there's anything that'll save him in there. He does get to mill me a little bit more when he hits me with Lazav. We do have Disenchant, which can deal with the sword. Oh, he did hit that. So he gets to Annihilator to me, but that's still probably not enough. He does swing for 19, though. I didn't see that when I was looking through there. But yeah, he doesn't get the creature back because it just entered the battlefield. It didn't enter the battlefield. Goodbye, lands. Hello, 19 damage to my face. Oh, that was enough commander damage, that's right. Stupid! Yeah, we were dead either way. Forgot about commander damage. Alright, well, you saw what our deck does, what this deck does. Hey, there's Kozilek. Um, and it was a lot of fun. We did not uh, win this match, but it was definitely fun. And we were, you know, a turn away from it. But yeah... This is a good matchup for our opponent where he can steal all of these massive creatures from us and just kill us two swings of commander damage. So, yeah, I should have left the cat back, though. I mean, that would have made all the difference in the world. It would have kept me from dying to commander damage. So I kind of made a, I made a big misplay because I forgot about commander damage. All right, well, thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.